Good morning. Welcome to Vlogmas Day 19. Wow. That means there are only six days left till Christmas and I'm super excited. I can't wait. I know I have a lot of um, errands to run and stuff like that. I have a lot of gift shopping to still do because it's just so hard after school. Like today after school, I'm going to be working a little longer because I have to do um, gingerbread houses and I have to prep them for the students. We're doing them on Friday, but I'm going to prep them tomorrow in case I don't have enough. Or I'm prepping them today in case I don't have enough material. Then I'm going to go ahead and buy more. Like, I'm just gluing the graham crackers together and building the base of the houses. So that when the kids come, all they have to do is just decorate and have fun. And so... It takes a while, you know, for the um, houses to stick. I already know that part, so I got to get that done. And so, yeah, I'm doing that after school without the kids. And that way they'll be so surprised. They'll get to see it, get excited so that by Friday they'll be ready to go. And so, yeah, that's what I'm doing today after school. So, you know what I mean? There's not much time after school in the day, even though... It should seem like there is, but no, not really. So I'm going to do that after school. And then, uh, you know, when I get home, see if I have any more important papers to get done and whatever, input grades and stuff like that. Because they want us to have our report card stuff done before break they're like you know if you can do it that'd be good otherwise it's due the very Monday you come back the very first day you come back so it's like basically unless you do it now you get stuck doing doing it during the um winter break which I don't want to do no one wants to do so we're all trying to get it done now so <laughs> on that note let's get ready for work um today's crazy hair day I'm not coloring my hair or anything I'm just gonna put it up funky maybe but oh, yeah today I woke up and I'm beginning to feel like I have a sore throat, which sucks. Um, yes, and I was a little stuffed, but it could be because it was cold. I don't know. I'm just hoping whatever it is will go away before Christmas because I've been doing so good. I was doing so good for a while without getting sick. Knock on wood. So I think I'm going to wear these today. And even though they don't look it, these are actually a dark navy blue pant and it has pockets and it's just it just looks really dark it looks like it's black but it's really navy oh it's kind of hard to tell can you kind of tell if I do this maybe from this view you can kind of tell I don't know but take my word for it this is a dark navy blue oh there you can kind of see it maybe and then what am I going to wear with it today I'm not feeling the greatest there's no funky things to wear because it's just crazy hair day so <sighs> I'm going to wear this I know that it's not weather appropriate but it's work appropriate it'll look good with the pants and again this is a dark navy blue but it looks black doesn't it maybe it's the camera I don't know but it really does look black from far but then in the right lighting, you can tell it's navy. Can you tell from here? Maybe. But I think it's pretty. I like that. And of course, it's going to be cold and I'm not feeling well. So I'm going to wear... I'm going to wear this one just because I'm not feeling the best right now. And this one's really comfy. This is my chenille sweater cardigan. I like it. Feels like a blanket okay so here is my outfit of the day for today I, I kind of like it so I have on we'll start with the shirt I have on this lavender navy and white sleeveless shirt I like the detailing on the top right there I think it's really pretty it just gives some style to my top and the bottom looks like this it's nice and flowy and it's not cropped or anything which is really good and then to go with it, I have a 
navy pant that looks like this. I love how the button and the zipper is covered so you don't see that. But yes, it's a navy pant right there and it matches really nicely with the top. In fact, I think I bought them together. I probably did. And then, but I always have a navy pant so even if I didn't, I would have had this anyways. And finally, to go with it is my light gray chenille sweater. And you can see that it's definitely a long cardigan sweater because the sleeves end there, but it still goes on, which I love. This is so soft and luxurious feeling. I love it and feeling sick the way I do. This will definitely keep me warm and comfy, almost like a blanket. So here you go, my outfit of the day, right there. That's nice, actually. So yes, I have a long day. I'm working after school for a little bit. So yeah, this will definitely keep me comfy and warm. I'll do a, a ultimate meat and cheese burrito. Uh, a combo. Tater tots. I love tater tots here. And then um, for the drink, can I, instead of a coffee, can I do like a, no, I'll do a coffee, yeah, yeah, that's fine. Iced coffee, iced coffee, yeah. Okay, do you want a flavor in that? Do you have French vanilla, hazelnut, and crazy syrup? I'll do hazelnut. Okay, and can you say that it was supposed to be a cheese cup? I'm sorry, what was that? Um, about the cheese cup, I didn't quite hear you. Oh yeah, tater tots, yeah. You don't want any cheese on them or anything? Um, is it free? Uh, no, we'll just keep it plain. Um, that's gonna be it. I don't know why there are wrinkles on it. I don't know why there's static. But here it is. My top. Sleeveless top. That has that navy lavender and white pattern on it. It is lined with lavender lining, which is really nice. It's very comfy, cool, and not hot at all. Um, I have on my navy pants. You can see that right there. And then I have on my chenille gray sweater, and it's so comfy. The sleeves are exactly perfect. I bought it at loft in a petite size, and it's exactly just right. In fact, I kind of wish it were a little longer. So kind of... Maybe next time I just won't buy the petite and sweaters because I like them oversized. There are no pockets. Nope, no pockets, but I love the length. You can see it's long, it's cozy, and it's so comfy. And as usual, bam, the black boots. I know I keep doing that all the time, but it's so funny. So yeah, it's my outfit of the day. I like it. And if I get super cold, I can just do this. Yeah, so. As for the animals on the shelf, they are here hidden by the tree. They're all admiring the Christmas tree. And then one of my students brought in Noodles, which is his elf on the shelf. And we placed him by the tree just so that he wouldn't play with him. Or I told him that that was his favorite spot because it's a Christmas tree, so yes. All of the animals and my student's elf is sitting there under our tree, which got a little bit fuller because I had a couple extra ornaments that the kids brought in. So I just put it there and you heard that bell, which means I have 10 minutes left before the students come. So yes, I'm going to go ahead and get ready. So my class is lucky because another parent brought in more stuff for the stuff of stocking. So, I am spending my lunch break, now that I'm done eating that kid's meal, I'm spending it stuffing the stockings even more, which is so amazing. <clears throat> if you take a look, the parent made this cute little goodie bag. Oh my gosh, my kids are going to be so spoiled this Christmas. And I'm so happy because as I mentioned, not everyone has stockings or ever had a stocking. And so my kids are so excited. Okay, I'm finally done at work. It is so dark. It's not as late as it seems, but you can see it's super dark. It's like 
past 5 p.m. But you know what? It's not as cold as I expected. I mean, it is cold, but it's all right. <laughs> so I'm just so happy to be done. All right. So I finally started wrapping gifts, and here's what I got so far. And oh my gosh, I'm starting to feel really, really good about this. I'm getting really excited. At first, I felt super overwhelmed, but once I started, I started just getting really into it. And it's looking good, guys. I am like loving it. Oh my gosh, I've done four gift bags already. And they include like the hand soap, the body lotion, and a candle. So three items in each gift bag. And I think it's cute. This first one is all Vanilla Bean Noel hand soap, body lotion, and a vanilla spice pear candle and guys this one's from last year and i think it's so beautiful because it has the marble cover on it and oh my gosh i bought a lot of these well not a lot but a lot for me and i was like i don't want to give it away but i know this person will love it it is such a pretty scent and it just looks so good together i mean the gold the white the marble i think this is such a really pretty looking gift bag I like that. The next one is like all Twisted Peppermint, Twisted Peppermint hand soap, Twisted Peppermint body lotion, Twisted Peppermint candle. This person loves Twisted Peppermint, so everything was Twisted Peppermint for this person. And then this one here, the person loves Twisted Peppermint, but they're not that much of a candle person. They buy it like once every so often. And I know they like Twisted Peppermint, so I got them the Twisted Peppermint hand soap, Twisted Peppermint body lotion and since they weren't that big into a really super super strong scents like i'm not sure if they would go for the twisted peppermint candle because it's really strong so i decided to get a softer version which is crushed candy cane and i think they will love it because they love candles just not like two in your face kind of candles you know what i'm saying so i think they'll love it because it's a softer scent plus the color is pretty it's just a really light soft pink candle as opposed to being super bright so they could use it throughout the year since this person kind of takes a while using candles so i thought that a simpler plainer candle would be better for them and finally this last item this person was specific about what they like i tell you so i made sure to get the items that they like the different scents so for the hand soap i got them the kitchen lemon which they said they loved and then i got them in the stars body lotion this is new but i know they love things that are pretty and shiny and i know that they love this type of scent so i went ahead and got this and the final item is their candle in champagne toast because i got them this candle last year they used it up and they're like i love that scent if you ever get me another candle i want that exact scent and i'm so happy that they have it because i was able to find it for them so i know that they will love it so yeah, that's what I've been doing right now, and I'm getting really, really, really in a good mood doing this. But guys, I gotta show you something. Yes, I dumped it all on my bed. Oh my gosh, on my comfy, comfy Christmas blanket. And so I need to continue wrapping all of this. Ah, I shouldn't have done it, but it's easier for me to see what's in here, you know what I mean? So that I can mix and match them the way that I should like for people that want them. I see my black cherry marble there. That's going to someone. I'm like, no, but you know what? I'd rather give it as a gift because I can always buy myself something later. And it's always nice to see the looks on people's faces when they get it. And this one here is so, so nice. Frozen Lake, Snow-Capped Mountain. Oh my God, I love those, but that's going as gifts as well. Um, but yes, I've got a lot of wrapping to do. So on that note, I'm going to go ahead and end Vlogmas Day 19. I hope that you like my video. I hope you share it with your friends. And if you haven't done so already, I hope you subscribe to my channel. Guys, thank you so much for watching and happy holidays.